coverage you can count on continues with Andy McDonald's Sports Report. Hey guys, Kevin Donnelly, he wears his sunglasses at night. The St. Francis head coach has led the Cougars to back-to-back -to -back NAIA national titles. I was in attendance in Dano Daytona Beach, Florida, covering a full and special weekend for St. Francis. To leave this as our legacy as, as seniors is pretty special. I, I don't even know, I can't think straight, but you know, it's been a blessing. It feels so good. As a team, we did everything together all week. We stayed focused with all the distractions. We got treated like a business trip. I mean, it's nice being in Daytona Beach, Florida. I mean, the weather's nice. It's great. But uh, we just have to have a business mindset. Big time, for sure. So we don't really want to get too hyped up in that. We know what's on the table, but we just want to come out here and, you know, kind of treat it like it's another game and just come do what we do. One, two, three, two trophies this weekend for you. I mean, how special of a weekend is this for you? A lot of emotion. Um, you know, uh, pretty pretty drained right now emotionally, but uh, it's amazing. Um, one of the one of the best couple days of my life for sure. So. National Player of the Year is Mr. Nick Ferrer. Got a little bit emotional, um, you know, just talking about Coach D, my parents, um, just stuff like that. People that mean a ton to me. So, um, and definitely, uh, and, and having to speak it too um, was uh, one of the best experiences of my life. It was, it was just, it was an amazing feeling. I mean, you sit there and think about all the things that you did when they were younger and how little they were and how much they grew up. And I told them I wanted to be known as one of the best quarterbacks to ever play here. But well, more importantly, I want to be known as a winner. You gave a big hug to Nick Ferrer there as you guys, their clock hit zero. What did you tell him and what does that mean to you? I told him I love him. He'll always be my son. I mean, how special is he to this program? Two, two trophies going home to Fort Wayne right now for Nick. He's a special young man. I hope he plays on Sunday. Um, he's a coach on the field. He's a leader. been a long tough ride uh, we had a heck of a season this year we fought through adversity all year and uh, you know what give it to the senior class great class they wanted it more than anybody else Let's go! it's one of the greatest feelings I've ever had and I'm I'm just very proud of my team and all my brothers we've been working long very hard for this about 11 months since last year so I mean it's just it's a great feeling we have sunk in yet that's the last game going out on back-to-back -back champs and Celebrate tonight, have a little fun, a lot of fun, so I'm, I'm excited. It's, it's an incredible feeling, for sure. Yeah, yeah. It feels great. Uh, you know, we, we, we got it done, and we played 60 minutes of football. We stuck together as brothers. It's been an honor to be a part of such a great program, great coaches, teammates. We love each other. We fight for each other every time we get out here, and, and you know, we, we, we made history tonight. Back to back national champions. How does that sound? Sounds pretty good. Um, sounds pretty sweet. Uh, you know, I, I never, I never imagined that I'd have the opportunity to win back to back national champion champs here at St. Francis. Um, I mean, I'm lost for words. Back to back. You get it, baby.